The first English trailer for The Boy and the Heron, the new Hayao Miyazaki's latest feature in collaboration with Studio Ghibli, The Boy and the Heron, has just released its official English language trailer. The voiceover cast includes some of the biggest names of Hollywood including Christian Bale, David Bautista, Robert Pattinson, and Florence Pugh, among others. The Boy and the Heron was released in theaters in Japan by Toho on July 14, 2023, however, is coming to the US-UK and Ireland in December 2023. Miyazaki is returning with a feature after 10 long years, so The Boy and the Heron has been in development for basically almost a decade. With the release of this film, slated for release on December 8 throughout the US, the acclaimed director will mark 11 mysterious and needless to say, beautiful projects to his name, 10 of them being in collaboration with Studio Ghibli The Boy and the Heron tells the heartwarming story of Mojito, a 12-year-old boy who is trying to find his place in a new town after his mother's death. His life takes a magical turn when a talking heron tells him that his mother might still be alive. Filled with hope, Mojito explores an old tower and finds himself in a different world. Through his adventure, he learns more about himself and how to cope with his feelings of loss. The film, although inspired by a 1937 novel by Genzaburo Yoshino, still maintains Miyazaki's signature and touching craft. Animated film from Studio Ghibli and Hayao Miyazaki is here. And if you want to hear Robert Pattinson as a talking bird boy do I have good news for you, the cast for the English dub of The Boy and the Heron had previously been announced and includes the talent of Christian Bale, Dave Bautista, Gemma Chan, Willem Dafoe, Karen Fukuhara, Mark Hamill, Florence Pugh, and, of course, Robert Pattinson as the titular Heron. Amid the ongoing SAGAFTRA strikes, a press release notes that the dub was produced in accordance with the SAGAFTRA foreign dubbing agreement. You can check out the trailer for yourself below, but it seems like a vibrant dub with a load of personality, and, of course, whether you're a dub or a sub-fan, the visuals look predictably spectacular. The Boy and the Heron is a bit of an odd case when it comes to trailers, as the film was released in Japanese theaters earlier this year with no major promotional effort.